Betty Boo, Mary, I'm sorry, I should have called you down earlier. Well, I see people point, here she comes. There's a lot of stories that came out of May 17th. I've got my own. It would have been a lot different if I hadn't been held up in traffic in Belmont and had gone around, come in the back way from the west side, and I was late. One of those nine crosses on that patch, one of those nine riders, one of us on the ground that didn't get up that day was Mohawk. On June 17th, this Texas flag flew over our state capitol. One month later, one month after May 17th. Mary, I present this to you on behalf of CORE in honor of Mohawk. Our defenders program 
need your help very bad back there to buy up the merchandise so we can get more patches and stuff. If you got anything, you got summer sizzle tickets are out. There's all kinds of things going on that we can do to help each other. Don't forget to help yourself first. Don't give till it hurts so bad you ain't got nothing at home. Don't do that. Don't make me go home feel like I took your last dime. Don't do that, brother. Don't do that, sister. If you need a dime, if you need cash today, before I put this in the bank, come see me today. Let's don't let this shit get out of hand where we lose something. Come see me. Don't swallow your pride. We're here to help. Let's close this in a prayer. Can I say that the, the fund that we have for the Christian Unity Fund that's being used to help those to this point, we've had, uh, today, we make our deposit, we have about $20,000 that's come in. We've spent, to this point, about $9,000. Just want to let you know where we're at. Let's bow our heads once again. Father, I thank you that you do care. You care about all of the things. You care about our rights. You care about our life. God, that you care about our families and you think about each one of us. Your word says that you know your thoughts toward us and your thoughts of good and not of evil. I pray right now as we leave this place, God, that we continue to be united in everything we talk about, everything we do. And I pray, God, that you give each one a safe ride home, a safe drive home. You help us join together again stronger than we ever were before. I pray a special blessing upon our leadership. God, I believe they're the people that you called this time, for this hour, for such a time as this. And I pray, God, that you just continue to lead them, encourage them, and God, provide for them too. I ask all of this in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ. And everybody said, Amen. Amen.